is a new floor plan that I personally haven't walked through yet, so I'm pretty excited to see it. It is almost 2,900 square feet, and it's got a three-car garage. It's four bedrooms, uh, three bathrooms, I believe, in a three-car garage. But yeah, this is the Kareem. I'm excited to see this one. And this one has um, an estimated completion date of October or November, so it probably won't be as far along as the other ones, but gotta love a long porch. It's all white on the exterior. Let's go check it out. This is, I thought it was black at first. I had to take my glasses off. It is a dark navy blue color for the door. Love the wide entryway. We have bedrooms off to the right. It's got a full bathroom. So this could be, a guest bedroom. So this actually isn't a bedroom. This is kind of like, so it's like a teen loft. That's pretty cool. So a nice little flex space up here and then another bedroom over here. It's pretty cool. Electricity isn't turned on on here, but luckily we have a lot of natural light. So it features tile, wood look tile. All right, so after the main entryway, here's another hallway over here. I really like this floor plan. This is gonna get a little dark. I'll have to come back whenever there's electricity set up. You got a little drop zone right here, bathroom. I'm guessing this is going to be your laundry room. It's pre-plumbed for a sink. And then you got another bedroom over here, full bathroom. So actually that one could be a good guest bedroom. And then coming down the hallway, air handler. This is great. A lot of counter space. A lot of cabinets. Look how much open space there is in this house. We'll go out to the patio in a little bit because it's a really large patio. This is your primary bedroom. Wish the electricity was on, but looks like there's his in her closet, so that's great. A lot of closet space. Large shower, little installed seat. Okay, so you have one sink over here, and then it looks like there's another sink over here, so we know that would be for his, and this would be for hers, but definitely a lot of cabinet space. All right, let's go check out the patio because it's pretty large. Look at that patio. Then you back up to a little pond. So this is probably where the actual property line would stop. It's a little sacrifice. It's 
far as the lot goes, but you could always fence in the sides and then keep the back open to make it feel a little bit larger. Pretty good space in between these two. It's always nice to have a little bit of a pie shaped lot because it opens up that side space from your neighbor. You have your gas stub, outdoor kitchen. This is a great house if you like entertaining or if you just like a lot of space. Let's look at all the counter space. Very large walk-in pantry. So much counter space on this island. It's huge. This one should be done by November, I believe it said. October, November. Yeah, let me know what you think.